Patch 112 brings long-awaited DLSS upscaling and in this video I will test how it improves performance in comparison with previous patch. As you can see from these two shots, the performance improvement between patches is minimal, so let's move to the test of the DLSS. Comparing hike preset without and with DLSS shows easy 5 FPS increase. But first thing that I noticed is that DLSS implementation in this game doesn't help with anti-aliasing as much as I'm used to from other games and you can also see some ghosting on moving cars. Both of these imperfections may be caused by low base FPS or version of implemented DLSS which is 3.1 instead of the newest version 3.7. Anyway, it's better than nothing and I'm glad that the game is moving in the right direction. Now let's compare optimized graphics settings in combination with DLSS. If you don't know what are optimized graphics settings, check out my other video by clicking on the link in the upper right corner or in the description of this video. Just remember that it was made for previous patch, so ignore the part about AMD CAS and use DLSS instead. By combining optimized graphics settings and DLSS, we can get another 5 FPS while maintaining most of the visual quality. This is the way I prefer to play the game from now on and I recommend it to everybody. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a lot of FPS and fun while gaming.